the state of Iraq. All bridges and some roads in the Gaza metropolitan area have been closed because of a severe weather wind. Meteorologists are tracking Hurricane Hermione, which has devastated five Caribbean islands and is heading to Vice City. More updates soon. Sweaty. You rude little turd. Get away from me, right? Is this the way it's gonna be? Get lost. Hello, Sonny. Tommy! Tommy, it's been too long. I know, I know. You're just overwhelmed with emotion. Fifteen years. Seems like only yesterday. I guess that's a perspective thing. Hey, doing time for the family is no piece of cake, but the family looks after its own, okay? So how'd the deal go down? You sitting on some white gold? Look, Sonny, we were set up. The deal was an ambush. Harry and Lee are dead. You better be kidding me, Tommy! Tell me you still got the money! No, Sonny. I don't have the money. That was my money, Tommy! My money! You better not be screwing me, Tommy, because you know I'm not a man to be screwed with! Wait, Sonny! You have my personal assurance that I'm gonna get you your money back, and the drugs, and I'm gonna mail you the dicks of those responsible! Hey, I already know that. You're not a fool, Tommy, but I warn you, neither am I. If it was anybody else, you'd be dead already. But because it's you, because we got history, I'm gonna let you handle this. Look, Sonny, you got my word. I'll be in touch.
Go get some sleep, he says. <laughs> I have been sitting in this chair all night with the lights off drinking coffee. This is a disaster. We are so screwed, man. These gorillas, listen to me, are going to come down here and rip my head off. It's re ridiculous. I did not go to law school for this. Okay, now what the hell are we going to do? Shut up. Sit down. Relax. I'll tell you what we're going to do. You're going to find out who took our cocaine. And then I'm going to kill them. That's a good idea. That's a great idea. Let me think, let me think, let me think. Oh, there's this retired colonel, Colonel Juan Garcia Cortez. He's the one that helped me set up this deal well away from Vice City's established thugs, okay? Now listen, he's holding his party out in the bay on his expensive yacht, and all of Vice City's big players are going to be there, okay? I have an invite. Of course I have an invite. But there's no way that I'm going out there sticking my head out the door. No I way, not I told you, happen. shut up. I'll go myself. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, I like 1978, too, but, you know, this isn't going to be a beer at strippers, do. I mean, no offense, but I think that you might turn heads on the runway for the wrong reason. What's wrong with the way I'm dressed? Okay, look, here. Stop by Raphael's. Tell him I sent you. He'll make you look respectable. Okay, go. Come on. Who's that guy think he is? Now I gotta dress like a chump as well as hang out with them? I like this shirt. Whoa, Good idea, pal. Not so big now, mister. Charlie! Go get some sleep, he says. <laughs> I have been sitting in this chair all night. Who's that guy think he is? Now I gotta dress like a chump as well as hang out with them? I like this shirt. Buenas noches. I understand you are here on the behalf of Mr. Rosenberg. I hope any recent problems have not affected his health or mental well-being, Mr. Rossetti. He's just got a touch of agoraphobia. <laughs> excellent, excellent. And you? I just want my merchandise. Ah, 
It's an unfortunate set of circumstances for all involved. Of course, I have initiated my own lines of inquiry, but such a delicate matter will take time. Perhaps we'll talk later. Meanwhile, let me introduce you to my daughter. Miss Edis! Karamia, could you look after our guest while I attend to my necessary obligations? Of course, Daddy. Please, excuse me. Mercedes? You try living with it. Anyway, let me point out some of our more distinguished guests. That's our congressman, Alex Shrub, with rising silicone star, Candy Sachs. And have you met my lovely wife, Laura? No? Well, uh, unfortunately, she's in Alabama. This is Candy. And over there, we have the Vice City Mamba's star titan, BJ. Always the charmer. I blocked down on him, and then I put him in a wheelchair. <laughs> <laughs> that is good. Well, now, I'm looking at some prime... And that poolside amphibian is Jez Torrent, lead singer with... Love fest. Yeah, can I tell you? Do you know how they play ping pong in Thailand? Let me tell you. It does not involve a paddle, <laughs> if you know what. Impotent. And the chatty trio, that sleeping sweat gland is Papa's right-hand kid, Gonzalez. And the other two are Pastor Richards and pseudo-intellectual film director Fish Steve Wall Scott. throws a passion with the nympho invaders when the giant shark comes in and just bites their dicks off. Now, you never saw anything like that before. Colonel, your party's as ever a triumph. <laughs> I can only apologize. Oh, the nada, amigo. How do we find you? <clears throat> Our business is very dry. Barbarians at the gate. A time for rewarding one's friends and liquidating one's enemies, amigo. Who's the loudmouth? Ricardo Diaz. He's Mr. Cole. Mercedes! Oh, I was just taking my friend back into town. Another time, Ricardo. Ricardo, let's go. Let's get the out of here. Sure Actually, take me to the pole position. Drinks. Will you be working for my father? Maybe. It's so difficult having a rich and powerful father. Vamos.
Ah, well, I hope you're having a good time, because I'm going out of my mind with worry here. What did you find out? That there are more criminals in this town than in prison. We need a lead from the streets. Okay, let me think, let me think, let me think. Ah, I got it! Okay, there's this slimy, some music industry slimeball. Goes by the name of Kent Paul. Anyway, he's got his nose so far up most of Vice City's ass that if anybody knows the whereabouts of 20 keys of coke, it's this guy, all right? He's always at the Malibu. I'll go pay him a visit. Take it easy now. Where'd you pop up from? I've been looking for a bird like you for ages, mate. You know what I am? Looking for some English guy. Kent Paul. Kent Paul, mate. Yeah, I'm the governor, Andy. I'll sort things out. You know what I mean? I'll treat you. Whatever you want, I'll get you, girl. Don't you worry about a thing, mate. Get lost, honey. Oi, 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 oi. I'm Kent Paul. I'm a friend of Rosenberg's. Rosenberg? Rosenberg? Oh, that bonkers ambulance chaser. That guy could defend an innocent man all the way to death row. <laughs> Get another drink, bruv. But he's a comedian. Listen to me. I'm missing 20 keys and a lot of cash. Drugs, mate? It's a mugs game. What do you know about it? Oi, oi, well, what I was coming to was, there's some chef come trumpet shifter who deals that kitchen of Hotel and Ocean Drive. He's been looking real pleased with himself lately. You could go and check him out. I will. And I'll be seeing you around. Yeah, that's right. Go and walk away, you mug. I knock you spark out. Give me a drink. And where's that slut? Hey, what you looking at? You better start talking. Hey, make me, you prick. This is what you want. Oh, way to go, tough guy. Beat him to a pulp. That should make him real chatty. You want some too? Hey, chill. I want what you want, brother. Oh, yeah? And what's that? Your green and my dead brother's white lady. Unfortunately, you just silenced our lead. Accidents happen. Get lost. Hey, hey, whoa. No need to go all long range on my ass. The way I see it, we two hombres in a strange town. We need to watch each other's back. My back's just fine, brother. You sure about that? Yeah, take this. Follow me. 
this way. You understand what this is? Damn idiots! 